the magic lace. Just imagine it on my body. Look at it. Isn't that amazing? I look sexy. What's up guys? Welcome back. I feel like it's been such a hot minute since I've sat down and filmed. Oh my god, you guys. Life has been throwing it at me, okay? I'm gonna do a life updates video very soon because I just, so much has been happening. Oh my god. I went to Melbourne recently and that was very exciting. Um, I did vlog my time while I was there. So you guys will get a vlog very soon if it's not already up. I feel like everything just kind of piled up and I was like, I feel like I was under a pile of bricks and everything was hitting me and I was like, help, help. And no one was there to help. And I just got, I just dug myself out and I'm back. I'm crawling, crawling back, but I'm back. I'm here to attack. You guys have probably seen some other videos up on my channel recently, but I would have filmed them like a few weeks ago. Um, Cause I kind of, I went missing for like three weeks there. Totally unintentional, but honestly, like I said, life just got on top of me and I've been really struggling with my mental health recently. I'm just gonna be real with you guys. I don't wanna put like a Debbie Downer on this video, but it's been tough. I've been taking baby steps in the right direction. And like I said, I will update you guys in a video very shortly. I'm good, I'm looking after myself and I'm finally kind of taking it seriously. And I just kind of had to take the time away to you know, make sure that, make sure I was good. Another thing that threw a huge spanner in the works for me was, I had a piercing recently. It got super infected. It was insane. I'm fine, but I am on antibiotics right now. So I'm just a bit spaced out. They're a very broad antibiotic because they're not sure, you know, what kind of infection that I have. So it's kind of to cover all bases. Um, but it does say on my packet not to drive with this. I can't eat specific foods because it'll make me throw up, makes me feel nauseous, um, and just kind of makes you a bit foggy. So bear with me, guys. I'm heavily medicated. Things are, things are going on over here. All of that aside, we are sitting down today and I am going to share with you guys some of my favorite pieces from Lounge, some new things that have just launched, and then some staple pieces that I think you guys should pick up if you're looking to pick up underwear. I'm just saying. This video is in collaboration with Lounge, which I am very excited for. You guys know I work closely with them and I have been for like the past year or so. I love their brand and I love all of their pieces. I also have a discount code for you guys as well, which is just KR10, capital letters for that. And that will save you guys 10% on your order if you want to pick anything up. But we're going to jump straight in. I'm going to show you guys everything I got and hot tot, let's go. First thing I'm gonna start off with is some clothing sets. Well, like it's just one set. So it's not really sets, plural, but like it's one thing. So yeah, I have been living in this. It's a bit wrinkly currently because I literally just got it out of the wash. As soon as I got it, I just, I was wearing it. When I flew to Melbourne, this is what I wore. So comfy and it's just so cute. So basically lounge have these little sets. They kind of like mix and match sets. So they have t-shirts, they have hoodies, they have little shorts, which I have a pair right here. So cute. These are made out of fleece and then they have um, tracksuit pants as well. So the jumpers and the tracky pants and the shorts are all made out of fleece. And it's like that really, that really toasty warm stuff. But this t-shirt is just like cotton. So this is a range that they've had for a little while now, but they've just brought out this ash white set. I got this in, I think I got a medium. What did I get? What does it say? What does it say? Where's my mirror? Medium, yes. Because I like my t-shirts to be a little bit bigger and I'm really glad that I did because if you guys can see, it's still really cropped. Um, the only places it kind of looks baggy is like around my arms, like the sleeves. But I would honestly prefer to have my t-shirt too big than too small and I just like to be comfortable. So I'm really glad that I got a medium. In the bottoms, I got an extra small. To be honest, I probably could have got a small. These are quite tight, um, but I have, I've gone up a, a size or something the last year, you know? Packed on some kilos. These are a lot more snug than I anticipated, but they still fit really well. I will insert a little clip right here of me trying them on. They have an elastic band and they have a drawstring waist as well. And I just, I love this really light, ashy white kind of gray. I think it's really cute. So that is the first set. So next up, I'm gonna show you guys 
some bottoms. I do have a couple more sets to show you, but I wanna, I just wanna throw off the underwears first because I really just wanna get some new underwear and just, you know, rotate the old ones out. Eventually let go. It's time to let go. I know I'm not the only one with 10 year old underwear. Just cause it lasts probably doesn't mean we should keep it. I love new undies and I really wanted to get some seamless pairs and some pairs that aren't particularly thongs, but they aren't particularly briefs either. So these are kind of like cheeky ones. So I've got three pairs here. They actually have a deal on the website where you can get three pairs for $50 or you can get six pairs for $90. So you could just mix and match and pick any bottoms that you want. One thing I will say guys, is that I'm not trying on these pieces today, but I'm going to put pictures up of each piece from the website. Honestly, that's really all you need. You don't need to see me in underwear. I know what it's like when nosy, I'm nosy. I watch these kinds of videos because I'm like, what does her body look like? And I want to see. I, I get it. I understand. But I'm just not feeling myself lately, guys. I haven't been to the gym. And I've just, my, my health hasn't been great. So I just, I'm not feeling up to it to stand in front of a camera with underwear on um, and then put it up for like hundreds of people to see. First up, a nude pair because nude underwear are an absolute staple. I got all my underwear in a size small. You guys know I typically wear an extra small, but I have started going up. The extra small is kind of cut into like my muffin top kind of area a little bit too much. They're just like a really soft satin kind of material on the front, very stretchy and really flattering. They don't leave any seams. And then the back is just like kind of sheer lace and it's pretty stretchy too and again it doesn't really leave any seams because it's just it's just like a little raw edge you know what i mean so these are really flattering i love this kind of underwear and i do have quite a few pairs similar to this my staple if i was to buy like no other underwear ever would just be nude seamless underwear because i just think they're so flattering they go under everything and they're perfect for underpants especially pants that kind of like skim over your bum area and that a little bit like more silky so i also got those in a purple lilac kind of shade and again they just have the same little cheeky back there actually are they the same or are they different are they the same or are they different they're the same no they're not so i thought these ones were the same but they're not these ones are a little bit more of a g-string style but then they've got like the thicker band up the top but honestly when i tried them on i didn't really notice any difference i think i just thought they were up my bum a bit actually i was like oh whatever because i was just quickly trying them all on to see if they fit um but yeah i didn't notice a difference they're still just as comfortable so i got those two in that style and then i just got a lace pair of black undies these are really really comfortable i yeah i just really really like them and again i got these in a size small as well i love these because they're kind of sexy but they're comfy i like to look nice and feel nice but i don't want it to feel like as sticks up my bum so anyway that's a really cool deal that i wanted to share with you guys if you're looking to pick up some new undies because honestly you can never have too much moving on to the little lingerie sets now so this one is the magic set the magic lace just imagine it on my body look at it isn't that amazing i look sexy the magic lace set is really really cute i already have this in a black and i really like it my bottoms are a small because like i said i like to go up in my underwear no one wants a muffin top. The band is really nice because it's not too thick. So I think it's really flattering and forgiving, especially if you size up. They're really soft. Like there's like this really nice cotton lining. It feels great against your vagina. And then the lace is just beautiful. You guys know that I love white and anything lacy is just and white at the same time. Oh, so nice. And then these are a g-string style at the back too really comfortable and really flattering i do find myself reaching for my black pair quite a lot and that's not something typical of like lingerie sets for me just on like typical everyday kind of wear if it's like a date night or something sure but mostly like every day i kind of go for my more comfortable underwear so i think it's it's nice that i reach for those ones and then we also have the matching bra as well so this is really cool because it doesn't have any underwire in it. It's literally just foam, but the foam kind of like lifts your boobies up and like, it's like there's underwire there, but there's not. And it's so comfortable. So if you're looking for something that's 
a little bit more supportive than a crop top, but something that's still really comfortable. I think this is a really good idea, especially like those little bralettes that you can get that are just lace. Sometimes I feel like my boobs look a bit triangly in those. So it is nice that you can wear something like this underneath like sheer tops and it still looks really cute. And it's, you know, people aren't gonna be like, oh my God, that's a t-shirt bra. They're gonna be like, oh, Where'd you get that bralette? That's cute. These are really stretchy and you can adjust them as well. Just a heads up with these ones as well, guys. This set, I feel in the bras, runs a little bit bigger. So I've gone with the 32C for this one, um, whereas I typically wear a 32D in most of their other bras. And the black one that I already own of this, I got in a 32D and I just noticed that the cups were a little bit big. So definitely size down in this one if you're worried. So this next set is the Blossom Balcony set. You guys would have seen me talk about this before i have this in the most beautiful red this is so stunning i love these they're so cute i used to be a smaller size in the cup just when i was like kind of figuring out my sizing um but now i get a 32d and this is much more my size i used to find that my boobs would kind of spill over a little bit and um my nipples would kind of poke through the lace because they were just a bit tight so a D is definitely the cup size that I need and I feel like these ones run a little bit small. So if you're worried with this, upsize with the cup size. <laughs> and then we have the matching bottoms as well. So I picked these up in a small. Again, I used to get these in an extra small and they're just they're a bit snog. Things have happened. I'm going to be 30 in two years and um, I just... Kilos are accumulating. I think this is such a perfect set going into Christmas or even Valentine's Day coming up next year. I don't know if you wanna to get to start early, like six months early, but I think they're really cute. I really love these sets and they've just launched new colors. So they came out with the red. I've got the black set as well. And then I think that there's a purple and a blue, but they do have these in really pretty pastel colors on the website as well. Exact same set, but this one is black. It's so pretty. I really love the mix of like the girly kind of lace and the boyish kind of lounge logo. You know what I mean? Cause it's kind of like minimal meets really girly. I, I just love it. I think it's so pretty. The next set I have to show you guys is so cute. This one's only just freshly launching. So while I'm filming this, this isn't even out yet, but by the time you guys see it, I'm pretty sure it would have launched. So this is the new mesh sets that they've come out with. So these are really cute. I've got these bottoms in a brief. I know you guys are shocked. Not a G-string? I know, what's going on? I'm just gonna say it, this is great. Period pants, right? It's black. Yes, it's mesh. That's probably not ideal. But you can still feel sexy while riding your crimson wave. I've really got to stop wearing my grandma underwear when it's that time of the month because it's, um, just because I've been with Hamish for 10 years doesn't mean I can let everything go. I feel like black lacy cute underwear is a really good way to kind of work around the whole period thing. I'm just saying. So the bra in this set is really cute. It's got actual, ah, I don't know what I'm doing with these right now. I'm just like hands. What's going on? I've got underwire in there too. So it holds your titties up, but also keeps them free and the breeze can just flow in. It's really nice guys. I really like it. It's a great time. This is really good just underneath the t-shirts and things like that. I really like it just underneath any of my casual kind of tops because it's just comfy, you know what I mean? It still holds them up, but I don't have to deal with like padding or anything like that. I find it really comfortable anyway. And I think it's just really cute, especially for those times when your man's wants to get all up in your junk. You're prepared, you're like, oh, you like that? Yeah. I'm casual like that. Super comfy and I really love that set. And like I said, that has just launched. If you wanna get your hands on it, I'll link it down below. Last but not least, guys, we have my favorite set. This is the Essential Bralette. Oh my God, it's so cute. I love this, I live in this. I've had this one a little bit longer than the others, but I really wanted to show you guys in today's video because I, I honestly live in this. It's the softest material. Like if you pick up anything out of this video, I recommend this one. I will say that the bralette itself is quite skinny, as you guys can see. Like it's it's not really like wide, like height wise. I find that it's like just enough to cover what I have. If you've got big ass titties, <laughs> maybe not. Um, but for like little boobies like me, I really love it. It is oh my god, I can't even I can't even describe to you this material. It's just so soft, 
so so stretchy and I just really love the color of this I'm not sure what this one's called but it's kind of like a gray pastel kind of color and I think all the colors that these ones come in are more on like the pastel sort of side and then I have the bottoms here so I have these in a g-string and these are so comfy really stretchy usually this kind of g-string I can't wear for too long because I'm like eh. like it's so skinny on the sides and I just get like annoyed so I usually save them for like special occasions and like sexy time but this is like super super comfortable I love wearing this it's probably my favorite set out of everything but that is it for like all the sets and the underwear that I have to show you guys today but I do just want to say lounge sent me a little um underwear washable bag for my laundry so thank you so much lounge that is so nice because i didn't even ask for this but i appreciate it so much so i think these retail for five dollars on the website definitely recommend picking one of these up i have one of these already not the lounge brand i just have like a random one i don't even know where i got it from but i always forget to use it and i actually have too much underwear and bras that they don't all fit in there at the one time so really happy to have another one this one's probably better because because it's see-through my other one isn't see-through and it's really annoying I just wanted to share that with you guys because I think it's really important when you buy nice underwear and you kind of invest in little sets and lingerie that you use one of these to wash them because it'll just stop them getting wrecked in the wash and I always find that I just chuck my stuff in there and it ends up getting like peeling and stuff on it and they just don't last as long. I almost forgot to mention as well that these boxes that I showed at the start of the video that all my stuff came in, these are the gift wrap boxes. So I'm pretty sure they do optional gift wrapping for $5 on the website. I'm gonna check really quick for you guys. So it says on my little brief that I have here that they provide the service of gift wrapping for five pounds. So I'm not sure how much that is Australian or how much it works out to be, but on the website, you have the option at the checkout that you can have it gift wrapped and it comes in one of these little boxes. So if you're sending it to a loved one or just yourself, you can gift wrap it, but they come with a lid and they're actually really handy and you can get little ones as well. I keep these and I actually use them in my underwear drawers and just any of my drawers in general, even my makeup ones, just to keep things separated. Hamish does it in his drawers as well and that way it stops everything from like being really cluttered. Just a little tip if you guys um, want to get the gift wrapping and you want to keep the boxes or something like that because I find them really handy for storage. But anyway, that concludes this video, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to use my code KR10 to get 10 percent off if you guys want to purchase anything um but yeah you guys are legends and i will catch you in my next one